your favorite Disney princesses. Wouldn't it be cool to imagine some of them as real live teenagers? Well, it is possible now thanks to these talented artists. Are you wondering what Anna and Elsa look like? You won't believe their transformation. Is this your first time on our channel? If so, make sure you click the like button and subscribe for more. Now, here are 10 Disney princesses reimagined as teenagers. Mulan. Where the Disney princesses before her all needed men to save them, Mulan was the one doing the saving. She was not afraid to make bold decisions. In fact, she even went against her family's wishes and joined the army without telling anyone. She pretended to be a man, knowing that if she got caught, she could be executed and would bring dishonor to her whole family. At that time, the highest honor was to find a good husband and get married. Mulan knew that she could not settle for that. So when her father got drafted into the army, she knew what she had to do. Her father was too old and sickly to join the army, so she took his place. Because of this brave decision, she found herself in several dangerous battles. Though she was a woman, Mulan ended up saving everyone from the opposing army. We think that as a teenager, Mulan will keep that sense of bravery and resilience that we saw in her when she was younger. She may get a tattoo or two, but she will never stop doing what she believes to be right. You go, Mulan. Belle. Beauty and the Beast was and still is a Disney classic. It's a tale as old as time. Boy meets girl and they fall in love. But in Belle's case, it was not that simple. The boy she met was no boy at all, but actually a fully grown, hairy beast. Belle was taken in as his prisoner in exchange for her sick father. Though she was a prisoner at his castle, Belle soon began to fall in love with the place. She enjoyed spending time with all of the magical appliances that lived in the castle. Everyone there soon became like family to her. She even began to see the beast in a different light. After a while, she saw that he was actually very kind and gentle. He just wanted to be loved like everyone else. In her town, Belle was known for being a bookworm. Everyone said that she always had her nose in her books, so much so that she would often run into things. We think that as a teenager, she will continue to read, but as with most teenagers, she might develop a bit of teen angst. She will pack the eyeliner on and maybe even get a sweet nose ring. Rapunzel. You probably know the age-old story of Rapunzel, but have you seen Disney's modern reboot Tangled? Tangled was Disney's version of the timeless tale. In this movie, a young girl named Rapunzel was stolen from her family and locked in a tower by a witch. In Disney's version, Rapunzel viewed the witch as her mother and did not see her as evil at all. In fact, Rapunzel actually loved the witch. Though the witch loved Rapunzel and Rapunzel loved her back, the witch would still not allow Rapunzel to leave the tower. Rapunzel was forced to grow her beautiful golden hair so long that the witch could use it to climb up the tower. Whenever the witch would come to visit, she would yell for Rapunzel to let down her hair so that she could come up. Rapunzel spent most of her days in solitude, never having anyone to talk to except for the days where the witch would come by. That is, until she met Flynn Rider. Flynn swooped in and changed Rapunzel's life forever. He helped her escape the witch's watchful eye. The two soon fell in love. We predict that as a teenager, Rapunzel will rebel from her witch mother and dye her beautiful hair black since her mother loved her blonde locks so much. Tumblr user must be paranoid brought this vision to life. Ariel. Do you believe in mermaids? If so, have you ever seen one? We would love to get the chance to see one of these amazing creatures. Unfortunately, we'll just have to stick to watching The Little Mermaid for most of our mermaid run-ins. In the film, Ariel was the youngest of her large family. All of her other sisters were content with their lives. After all, they were mermaid royalty. Their father, King Triton, ruled over the entire sea. But Ariel knew that she needed more. She would often sneak off to little caves to explore, when foreign objects would drift down to her part of the ocean, she would collect them and imagine what the humans used them for. Eventually, she was given the opportunity to become a human. All she had to do was give her voice to an evil sea creature. While in human form, Ariel spent a lot of time with a rich prince named Eric. She eventually fell in love with him, and while his love was reciprocated, he almost married someone else. We predict that this heartbreak will cause Ariel to be a little more angsty as a teenager. She'll probably dye her hair and get a few tattoos. So what do you think? Merida. Traditionally, in Disney movies and fairy tales in general, the women are soft and a bit weak. Most princesses have to wait around for a prince to come and love them. Others are cursed, and the only way to break the curse is often with a kiss of true love. But Brave changed all that. The main character Merida may have been a princess, but all comparisons with other Disney princesses stopped there. Merida was the daughter of Scottish King Fergus and Queen Eleanor. They wanted her to be a good, mild-mannered little princess, but Merida had other plans. She loved the wild and going on adventures 
years, her hair was almost always unkept. Merida knew there was more to life than curtsies and looking nice. She was a skilled archer and wanted to use that ability to make her own route in life. She sought the help of a witch who unknowingly led her down a path to an awful curse. She had to use her courage and abilities to break the curse and discover what her purpose really was. We predict that as a teenager, Merida will still have big curly red locks. She will probably take better care of them and do a better job of keeping them tamed. She will also probably stick to her signature green clothes. They look so good on her. Beverly Love did a great job illustrating this. Jasmine. Growing up, Aladdin was one of our favorite movies, but it was not because of how dreamy Aladdin himself was or the amazing adventures that he went on. No, it was one of our favorites because of Jasmine. Though she was not the main character of the movie, she stole the show. If that wasn't cool, then we don't know what was. Jasmine often felt caged in by her royal status. Everyone knew who she was and everyone loved her from afar, but she did not have any real friends besides her, you know, tiger. She would often sneak out of the castle so that she could just be herself. On one of her adventures outside of the castle, she ran into Aladdin. The two had a wonderful afternoon together, and Jasmine finally felt like someone had seen her for who she really was, not just a princess. We predict that when Jasmine is a teenager, she will move further away from the perfect princess persona that her father wants her to be. Maybe she will even get to wear sweatpants outside of the castle. Who knows? But we think this illustration by Beverly Love looks great. Snow White Snow White was probably one of the purest Disney princesses around. She was so kind to everyone and loved animals. It does not get much sweeter than that. She was also extremely beautiful. She was so beautiful that her stepmother wanted to get rid of her. She hired a huntsman to take care of Snow White and bring back her heart as proof. Because of her beauty, the huntsman could not do it and allowed Snow White to live. Snow White then moved in with seven little dwarves. She became like a mother to them, and they all loved her. She did the cooking and the cleaning and made sure they were all over. Okay. The dwarves and the forest animals became Snow White's new family, and she loved them more than she had ever loved her old family. Unfortunately, her stepmother eventually found her and tricked her into eating a poisoned apple. The apple held a curse that put Snow White into a deep sleep until true love's first kiss. Later in the movie, Snow White was rescued, but we never got to see her living her life as a real teenager. We predict that as a teenager, her pearly white complexion will have a few pimples, and maybe she will even have to get braces like most teenagers do. Don't you love Lauren Brance's depiction? Tiana. Tiana is one of the newest Disney princesses. She was also the first African-American princess to join the Disney crew. Tiana was always unique among the other princesses because she had to work her whole life. When Tiana was young, she would often cook with her father. That was how they bonded. After he passed away, she dreamed of opening a restaurant in his honor. But in order to achieve that dream, she had to work. She spent her days cooking and cleaning at the local restaurant in order to save up the money to buy and open her dream restaurant. While she was doing this, she happened to kiss a frog at a party. Little did she know, the frog was cursed and she was turned into a frog on the spot. Tiana spent the movie trying to figure out how to reverse the spell and become human again. During this time, she fell in love with the other frog, who was actually a prince named Naveen. We predict that as a teenager, Tiana will definitely open her restaurant. She'll probably wear a lot of clothes with frogs on them since, you know, she was a frog at one point. But she will definitely keep her hardworking, kind demeanor. Michelle Macias did a great job bringing our vision to life. Anna. It's hard to be a little sister. It is even harder when both of your parents are dead and your sister is all that you have left. That was exactly Anna's situation in the movie Frozen. When she was younger, she and her older sister Elsa were extremely close, but one day Elsa just stopped playing with Anna. For Anna, this meant extreme rejection. She spent the majority of her time trying to figure out what went wrong and what she had done to cause her sister to dislike her so much. After a big party at their castle, Elsa ran away and Anna knew it was her duty to find her sister. Just before her sister left, Anna met a handsome prince who seemed to be perfectly made just for her. She immediately fell in love and then set out to find her sister. Little did she know, the guy she was in love with actually sought to destroy her. The movie followed Anna on her extraordinary journey to find her sister. We predict that as teenagers, Anna and Elsa will become best friends again. Nothing much will change about Anna other than the fact that she will probably start to wear makeup. We love you just the way you are, Anna. Artist Nina Fullmetal got the picture perfectly.
Elsa. Do you know what it's like to hide a part of yourself? Everyone can relate to feeling like you are weird or out of the ordinary, but Elsa had to pretty much hide who she was from everyone, including those closest to her. We certainly could not imagine that. As a child, Elsa discovered that she had powers. She could freeze anything that she wanted, but one day she accidentally froze her sister, Anna. After that, she decided to keep her powers to herself. She didn't want to hurt anyone, and she didn't want to seem like a freak, but no one can hide who they are forever. One day, while at a party, Elsa's powers accidentally came out in front of everyone. She was forced to run away so that no one could try to trap her or hurt her for her powers. With her sister's help, Elsa was able to overcome her fears and accept herself for who she was. We predict that as a teenager, Elsa will be one of the coolest teenagers around. No pun intended. She'll probably become closer with her sister, and the two will have a relationship that can stand the test of time. Artist Nina Fullmetal really made teenage Elsa come to life. That's it for 10 Disney princesses reimagined as teenagers. So what did you think? Were you surprised at how some of the princesses looked? Do you think any of them should have turned out differently? Let us know in the comments. And if we forgot any princesses that you would like to see as teenagers, let us know. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.